Hey guys, it's Ro. I got some more requests from you guys to play more games, so that is exactly what we're gonna be doing today. I love crime solving shows, anything with mystery and detectives, and NCIS is one of my favorite shows. I'm currently watching season 14. <laughs> and I just found out that NCIS just came out with a new game to play, so I decided to partner with NCIS and their team to make this video. I went all out, I dressed up as one of the characters that you can pick in the game. In the beginning, of the game you have a few different characters to choose from and I chose this one. So I'm officially Special Agent Row. I'm also babysitting a little canine unit right now. It's a pretty sweet job really to be a canine unit because you don't gotta do paperwork. Freeze! My name is Agent Cookie and I'm here for your treat. I've got the game here on my iPad. The little game icon has got Agent Gibbs and Abby. All right, it's time for some good times and to solve some crimes. Boop. Here we are loading into the game. We've got characters Vance, Bishop, McGee, Dinozo, Gibbs, Abby, Palmer, and Ducky. Let's press play and see what happens. We're opening up, looks like we're in DC. Oh, we've got two people. They're struggling. Oh no, not the teddy bear. Oh no, we've got a murder. Looks like it's gonna be a case of who done it. Thank goodness Gibbs is here. Got a murder at Capitol Mall Park. Victim's a reporter. His wife is a former Marine. She's the military liaison at the White House. Time to grab your gear and look for evidence. Get to work. 10-4 out the door, here I go. Capitol Mall, here I come. Here we are at the scene of the crime and it looks like we've got to find all of these objects. We have to find a handgun, snow globe, George Washington, and a bobblehead. Oh, and a teddy bear. And it looks like if you find them in this order, you get some type of bonus, like a multiplier. I've already found the bobblehead and there's George Washington. There's also a snow globe on the table. And there's something in the lawn. I'm gonna pick that up. Oh, new evidence, there's the handgun. I'm gonna tag it back and bring it back to the headquarters. Then we have victim's body right here. New evidence, bag and tag and seal it. And teddy bear. Oh, so sad, a broken teddy. New evidence, collect that evidence. Scene cleared. Looks like it's gonna be showing my score here. And I've earned half a star and some items to trade. I'm a probie, which is a probational agent, so I've gotta earn those stars. I'm basically like a rookie. Gibbs has got another update for us. There were no fingerprints on the handgun you found. Ballistic will be able to confirm if it is the murder weapon. Get the teddy bear to Abby. Ducky has the victim's body in autopsy. Agent Anthony Dinozo is here. He wants to tell us that objectives are located here. Tap on the objective to start the analysis. Looks like we can tap on victim's body. Hit start and teddy bear. Hey, it took some of my coins. I hope it's worth it. Looks like a little puzzle. We're gonna have to piece this together. Let's put this teddy bear back together. Let's put his head on. There you go, teddy. And you're missing your face. No, oh, that's a cute face. Let's put your little leg on. Let's put this little piece of tech in here. It looks like a camera or a recording of something. Put this little gadget in there. Da da, we did it! Examination success. And my reward was energy. I'll take it. Let's go. It's Abby! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. She's one of my favorite characters from the show. For those of you who aren't familiar, she is our forensic scientist. Hi, Proby, I'm Abby. The teddy bear you brought me is actually a nanny cam. I knew that was a camera. Luckily, it was still active and taking pictures just before the murder. One photo shows the victim's wife, Frances Coleman, and a mysterious blonde-haired woman. Tony can help you check the database for this woman. The next scar found in the teddy had the victim's blood on it. It had a strong smell of woman's perfume. Our killer must wear it. Ooh, a lady perhaps? We shall see. Something to add to our criminal profile. They wear perfume. Also got some new evidence. We got this suspect photo. Our mysterious lady. We're checking in with Dinozo. He's got the results for our victim's body. Let's go check him out. 
Ducky, our medical examiner, has an update for us. This one's pretty straightforward, Jethro. Oh, 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 oh. Mr. Coleman suffered a single gunshot to the abdomen and died of blood loss. Painful, but likely quick. Earlier, I sent the bullet I removed from the poor man to Miss Shudo. That's Abby. She just shared that the ballistics report confirms the bullet is from the gun you found at the crime scene. You have the murder weapon. Interestingly, I also found pulled strands of blonde hair under the victim's nails, likely due to a struggle with his killer. That seems like a pretty important clue. Thanks, Duck. Yeah, thanks, Ducky. We've got something new to add to our criminal profile, blonde hair. And a new piece of key evidence, the handgun. I'm gonna file this. Agent Denozo's got some news for us. Bishop left a hard copy of the files on the victim's wife. Check my desk in the squad room. Let's also access the identification biometrics database, see if we can find a positive match from the picture of that mystery woman on the nanny cam. The suspect photo you found may be of use in this scene. Okie dokie, artichokey. I'm on it, Denozo. I'm moving down the street to the squad room. Enter the scene to find the clue. Agent Rowe is on it. This is gonna happen. Looks like another find the objects. Play. Okay, guys, so in the game, you can connect with your friends on Facebook and invite their characters to come help you collect evidence. I'm just gonna give my favorite agent a call and ask her to come with me. Hello? Hey, girl, how's my favorite special agent? Oh, hey, Ro. I'm good, just hanging out with my German Shepherd. What are you doing? I'm still babysitting the new canine unit. I was hoping I'd get a German Shepherd, but they sent me something else. Okay, well that sounds cool. What's going on with you? I've been working on a case. I could really use some extra energy, some extra eyeballs. Is there any way you could help? Well, it is my day off. What kind of crime is it? It's a murder case. There's a lot of evidence, a lot of clues I'm trying to put together. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Where should I meet you at? Could you come meet me at the squad room? I'll meet you there with some coffee if you're available. <laughs> you know me. I can't say no to coffee or solving crimes. Cool, see you there. All right, see you soon. Squad goals in the squad room. Once again, the items that we're looking for are up top. We've got Comex messenger bag, laptop, and highlighters. They even give you little clues. They're like, this is what the item looks like. Ah, I see this item. It is on top of the desk right over there. Oh, oh, the highlighters. They're right there on the desk. Nice set. Oh, we got a messenger bag. That messenger bag totally matches my outfit. Let's take it. Boop. Now we're looking for suspect files. There's a lot of files going on in this office. They'll have a picture attached to the front of them. Yeah, here they are. Boop. A new evidence. Let's collect this. I'm not sure if this is relevant to the case, but I'm going to take this toy boat with me. Score, and some comics. I think every good agent needs a stack of comics. Boom. Let's make sure to check the mystery photo in the database. Drag and drop the photo onto the relevant glowing objects. I'm gonna drag it over here. Ooh. Matching software is happening. Oh my gosh, is this a match? Lucy, Lucy Diaz. Diaz, I'm gonna put this new evidence in my file. Girl, you are looking mighty suspicious right now. You have blonde hair and everything. Oh, I got a reward. Two more hints, I'll take them. Scene cleared, all right. Points, 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 points. Thanks for the coffee. Call me anytime, as long as there's coffee involved. Let's head back to Denozo. It seems the victim had a life insurance policy. The beneficiary, his wife, of course, Frances Coleman. The database ID'd our mystery woman. Her name is Lucy Diaz. She's employed at the White House in the same department as Frances Coleman. The plot thickens. Gibbs is rule number 39. There is no such thing as a coincidence. Let's bring him in. We officially have a new suspect, Lucy Diaz, and Francis Coleman. Gibbs, 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 I swabbed the two suspects in custody. They both tested positive for the perfume we found on the neck scarf inside the teddy.
Also, we discovered that Lucy Diaz met the victim regularly at a hotel over the last month. Maybe they had an affair and he wouldn't leave his wife. Nice work, Abs. We have our two suspects and enough details to make an arrest. Make the right choice, Proby. Here's our two suspect files. We have Lucy Diaz, who wears a perfume, and Francis Coleman, who wears the same perfume. Before I make an arrest, it looks like I need to get some more coins, so I gotta go visit Abby. Tap Get to locate items in scenes. Claim coins for item sets collected. Looks like we're going to Capitol Mall. Drag the pieces back into place. Oh, this looks like a different puzzle. It's all out of order. Looks like I've got to drag this back into position. Doo, 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 doo. This goes over here. Then I'm gonna move this over here. Doo, 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 doo. Move this here. Build this together. Almost there. And then, almost there, final step. Then this one goes all the way over here. Boop, 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 to the left. Scene cleared, we did it. Points, 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 points. And I almost got a full gold star and I got a bunch of other items to trade, lots of coffee. Abby is gonna be happy. Now that you have all of the items, you can claim your coins. Cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. You can complete an objective now, Proby. Let's resume the episode. Now we're gonna make our arrest. Great job, now we have enough coins to arrest a criminal. We've got two suspects. Let's review them and make an arrest. Ah, oh, we meet again, Lucy and Francis, if that is your real names, ladies. Let's check out our first suspect, Lucy. She had the perfume and she's got blonde hair, which was found underneath the fingernails. So she's got two evidences against her. She's looking mighty suspicious to me. Let's review Frances now. She has the same perfume, but she doesn't have blonde hair. And I don't think I can make an arrest just based on perfume. What do you guys think? Do you think it's Lucy? Or do you think it's Frances? I'm gonna have to go with my gut on this one. My gut is telling me it's Lucy. Everything matches up, you guys. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna spend my 20 coins and make an arrest. Fingers crossed. Oh, 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 it's a match, it's a match. Guilty, we got her. Lucy Diaz, we have the photos and perfume that tie you to the crime scene. And your blonde hair was under James Coleman's fingernails. Talk. He faked loving me to get evidence. I hope you liked all the pretty images from that foul teddy, Agent Gibbs. James should have stayed away from us. Us? And who would that be? If you don't know who we are now, Agent Gibbs, you will soon. James was not the one we were after, though. His wife is more important to our mission. Frances Coleman? What do you want with her? It's not her. It's her place on the checkerboard, Agent Gibbs. You caught me, but my brothers will complete the mission. You've already lost. Tell your brothers I'll be waiting for them. <laughs> Lucy Diaz arrested. Boom. Congratulations, that was fast work. Lucy Diaz is in custody, but I'm afraid we have a bigger problem than just this one case, Gibbs. You and me both, Leon. Let's keep an eye on Francis Coleman. Dun dun! We completed the first episode and now we have unlocked the second episode. Right when you unlock episode two, they put you into a new case. This one is called Big Bang. All right, this looks like a good place to stop. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had fun solving some crimes. If you're interested in checking out the game NCIS Hidden Crimes, I'll put a link down below. It is free to play. Also, a big thank you to you guys for suggesting another gaming video. This was very fun. And a thank you to NCIS and their team for making this all possible. I appreciate it. I had so much fun. Let me know also down below if there's any other games that I should check out out and play. All right, thanks again, you guys. Bye-bye. Good job, Agent Cookie. <laughs> here you go. Oh, there you go, Cookie.